Hello my friends and subscribers, my name is Alexander Stepanov. In this fantastic video I'm gonna show you the full process, how to make the miracle, how to transform these hard nails. I will be using gel nails technique and I'm gonna show you all the secrets step by step. So you need only the professional kit for working with the gel. And as you can see, I'm removing now, removing now the gel. Um, and I'm using again the barrel gel bead. This gel bead is the perfect. I am use it for removing the nail design and liftings. Don't forget at first to disinfect hands of the client because some subscribers told me about it. But the problem is that I do not usually show the full process of how I work with these nails. And of course, I always disinfect nails before the work. And after that, uh, we should work with cuticles. And don't forget to roll down cuticles again and again, and you will see that I'm using the pusher uh, time after time. So it's needed to uh, not only to roll down cuticles, but to make sure that you applied everything perfectly and we don't have any remaining uh, particles of the skin. So guys, after uh, removing the gel and rolling cuticles, um, we're using the flame drill bead. This is the diamond drill bead and you should always, you should always use it. Uh, because we, we need to prepare the nail plate perfectly and remove the pterygia. And also, uh, the second thing I'm gonna show you guys, you can see my pinky nail and you can see also the flame of fire of the pinky nail. In this video I'm gonna show you um, the common mistakes that nail technicians do when they don't have any education and when they do this without special um, this the special education. So let's come back to our work. I'm using only the forward speed uh, for removing pterygia now. This is the uh, hardest technique because you should because you should twist the hand of the client perfectly using your fingers. Okay, and the next the next step I'm gonna show you guys uh, the special uh, drill bit for skin. I have never had, uh, have never had experience with uh, making records for showing this drill bead how it works. But in this time, I'm gonna show you all details. As I promised on the beginning of the video, I'm, uh, I, I want to tell you about the common mistake. So when we make too much pressure on this drill bead, and when we use it with the wrong corner, so we can make the flame of fire, as you can see on my pinky nail. That means you make something like the hole in the center of the nail plate. And when my students um, learn this technique, I'm giving my hands them um, to try. Um, and so after the next, the next week, uh, they see their mistakes. And then the next time they will never repeat that mistakes. And so the main thing when you work with drill bit for skin, you should work with, with the right corner. You should place it diagonally on the nail plate. And the next thing when we work with the ball drill bit, don't make too much pressure on it when you when you are removing the skin, the particles of skin. Uh, because you can also the hurt the skin of the client um, when it um, twists very fast uh, it, it can burn the skin so you should control the speed I can suggest you to work on the medium speed and you should control your motions you should uh, make something like um, something like um, erratic motions when we are removing the skin. Okay, we can also every time come back again and again using the same drill bead. For example, uh, you can see that uh, we have remaining skin. So we can return 
to the flame drill bit and remove again the pterygia and you can also uh, continue with this uh, drill bit for skin and you can finish with the ball drill bit. You can use different sizes of ball drill bit for, for example, for fine work. All tools and products you can uh, buy in my store. Just contact me on my email and make the list of products you need. I will make the package for you and send you. You will get it in two weeks and you, you, can, you can be sure that my products will work for you perfectly because they were tested for uh, four gears. Let's come back to our work. As you can see, I have finished with the manicure and we should remove, um, remove uh, the dust, brush of the dust and we use the gel primer. As you can see, I'm applying the coat of the gel primer very neatly and I'm not go going to put it on the skin. We, um, we, we, uh, we cure uh, the primer in LED lamp in 30 seconds. And after that, I'm gonna show you the next fantastic thing in this video. I invented the new formula of the base gel. And as you can see now in Russia, it's very popular to apply the alleged of the nail plate. Nail masters don't want to uh, shape nails at all. They just remove the gel using drill beads and they put some base gel on the top of the nail it, and it, it, it's, it's not need to allege it's not need to shape after the base gel, the nail pad at all. And now you see the base gel with the, the perfect formula, so it's a little bit thicky and it doesn't burn the nail plate, as you can see. At first we, sh we should cover the nail plate with thin layer of this gel, base gel, cure it 30 seconds in UV lamp, and after that we place the drop on the top of the nail, don't forget at the end to reverse the hand this way and um, it will help you to, f to make the final alignment. We curve the nail in an UV lamp or a LED lamp in one minute. So now guys I'm gonna show you the, the next uh, perfect product that I have never told about before. This is the perfect gel paint of the brand Sherry Dance. This has fantastic dark coffee color and I'm gonna show you guys how to work with it and apply it on the cuticles. Uh, be careful uh, now. Uh, I don't, at the first layer, I don't put the product very close to cuticles. And as you can see, on my first attempt I had a fault and I put it, uh, the product on the skin. So, you can fix it this way, I'm using the wipe and rubbing alcohol, I'm cleaning the skin and after that I'm, I'm making the, the second try and um, apply the coat uh, neatly and perfectly. And when you make sure that everything is good, you crew it in lead lamp. So it's needed to only two or three coats of this gel paint to make it perfectly. We cure this coat in lead lamp in one minute and after that I'm using thin brush number zero or zero zero and using this thin brush I'm placing the product under cuticles as you can see and it's uh, the small secret that Russian nail technicians used to create miracles with these nails. It's also very popular now when the product is placed very deep on the cuticles. We have we work a lot uh, for preparing the nail. We work with the skin, and now, okay, guys, and at the end, we are applying the top coat. We we are covering the nail. We are covering the nail with thin layer at first and after that I'm, uh, I'm taking 
the light drop of the top cord and applying alignment of the nail plate again. When we make sure that everything is good, we place the nail in lead lamp and wait for one minute to cure with and after that we are removing the tacky layer from this nail and now at the end I'm gonna show you how to apply fantastic nail design using gel paint of the brand Giorgio Cappuccini I'm using only white color of this gel paint now as you can see now I'm opening the jar of the Giorgio Cappuccini gel paint and I'm using thin brush number 00 I dip this brush into the jar of this gel paint and take one drop from this jar and using the simple technique of drawing roses I'm sure this technique will be actual all the time so you should to learn how to easily draw this rose and I think your client will be happy with this nail design so at first we make the drop on the center of the nail and make uh, something like the arch or the cure and after that we are surrounding this flower with thin lines sometimes we make the pressure on the brush and sometimes we move the brush with only the tip and this is it we have fantastic rows here we go guys you can see Fantastic nail design with the latest technique of Russian style hardware manicure. You can use this technique and create fantastic nail designs. If you like the, the format of this video and if you want me to continue these fantastic tutorials, just tell about it down in the comments. Or if you have any questions, you can ask me. I will answer your questions and give you some tips. Don't forget to click that like button. If you need something from my store, you can contact me on my email. I want to hug you guys. I'm kissing you. Bye bye. See you in the next video.